so here I am. The very next day. The apple I laid here, that normally someone would say is going to waste, has been eaten by a bird, bugs, all sorts of things. The energy is always consumed by yourself. What aspect of yourself will it be con consumed by? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. If you are eating a dead bird, or that dead bird is eating your food, it's just two different ways. It's all for everything else. It doesn't matter what aspect of everything else. It's for. I don't gotta contribute to other people. I can help other creatures on this planet. I can just help myself if I wanted to. But of course I've got this urge to want to help the most amount of everything ever. Because more and more is better. More is better. asking a teacher. It's like asking another part of your mind if you're looking it up on the internet. It's tapping into a, another dimension, a cyber realm. Downloading the information into this vicinity. There's no way to escape any of it. What? Where'd that come from? Where'd that come from? That word right there. That escape. There's no way to escape. I can just escape right now. Anything ever always is escaping. Hi. Just chilling. Just chilling. Chilling. Yeah. Meditating. Yeah, always. Just like in the wind, touch your toes. Yes, and my everything. Always. I like your vibes, man. Thank you. I like yours. Thank you. See you tomorrow. See ya. Hmm. I got a compliment on my vibes. I told them I like their vibes, too. That's not a lie. I like their vibes. Because their vibes is any vibe that I could possibly like. And them liking my vibes is... Me. Is them liking themselves. Loving themselves. All that, all that cheesy... All this cheesy stuff you hear about love yourself. Da -da 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 love yourself. It's good. It's good to love yourself. Love isn't even okay. I figured it out. I finally figured it out. Love isn't even. The opposite of hate. It's not. There are no opposites. 
opposites. Love is like, love is above good and bad. just because yeah you don't gotta be anywhere that's not comfortable when you can be places that is comfortable <laughs> right obviously obviously everybody out here is trying to be comfortable trying to be comfortable in their own body But when you realize that anywhere you could be is your body, is your society, is your land, is your energy, is your vibe, I like your vibes. When you realize that, it's, it's just a matter of preference, like where you want to be, because you could be anywhere but you're right here right now in order to experience what it is infinity needs to experience right now, right here. It's what infinity needs to mark off its checklist. Because infinity is a being in the clouds. Nah, beyond there. Beyond there. The other stars that are affecting us. The constellations. No, no, no. Beyond there. Larger, way out there. What is that? What's outside of here? Outside of this skull? Where do you begin? That's just the basics. Where do you actually begin? You are all of this. You are all of this. You are all of that. And all of these are just comforting words. That's all they are. It's comforting words. the language. Wordsmithing. In order to create a perception. Because we're given these words. And in a way, it's being given a perception. It's given a, a uh, like an equation. What's up? Thank you. Happy life. Happy life. See, he said happy 420 to me. And I said happy life. It's just it's instantaneous. Like, why, why was it that I said happy life? Out of anything I possibly could have said, I said happy life. What that aspect of infinity is right there for me to say it. Happy. Holidays. What is the deal? What is the deal with holidays? Holidays are like words, sort of. Giant words. Beyond that, years, time, concepts, they're all entities that we have given power to by thinking about it, by celebrating it. I say a word like infinity, I, I use a concept such as time, or a concept such as infinity, and that expands it, gives energy to that aspect of infinity in order to expand it. But, you know, whatever 
beyond all these reductionist type things, picking out vibe, picking out frequency and all that, it's all one giant entity experiencing itself. Real? I thought we I thought we were past that. And why are we still thinking about things being real? The whole thing with nothing being real and your perception being only your perception that Im that spirals into the next realization. of everything being real and everything is your perception and your perception is real and there's nothing wrong with your perception even if you have a perception about having a negative perception over having a negative perception about having a neg negative perception that's your perception it can just it can just move down. But through a little bit of maneuvering through the matrix, we're stuck in. We can't escape. Can we not escape it? Or can we just silence that monkey mind and transcend it? Possibly, that's what they say, to detach from it, fly away in a spirit body, experience somewhere else, possibly. perception and your perception can be manipulated energy can be manipulated we are manipulators of energy wow so my phone case looks like a little like i got painted a little person on there and so i'm standing here talking to an entity that represents all of the cyber realm that will be uploading this too and you will be getting a download. You're getting a download right now from the collective consciousness of humanity, which is part of the collective consciousness of existence itself. Anything that possibly will or could exist. But yeah, holidays, holidays are fun. People are fun. But I like myself. I like people. They're myself. Hi. How's it going? Good, how are you? See, you said, how's it going? It's more uplifting to change their day and make them make their minds blown and make them think about something 
intense or make them feel good. Just a simple compliment. Uh, but I guess it has to go. circumstances tell 